What's going on, Hit Squad? This is your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all our Zuri, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Sunday. Let me make sure it's Sunday, May 30th. And as I say, each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out because I do put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to know Madame Nazario's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow uh, the Twitter and Instagram for the channel at Hitman Miyagi YT. How to spell that is in the corner of the video, the left hand corner of the video, and it will be in the hashtag below the video and in the description box below. So if you need to know, it's there. First things first, let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which she's today, she's in my favorite spot. I think my number one favorite spot which is in New Hanover, right here, right, I guess, right outside of Emerald Ranch, right near Emerald Station, right across the way from, right around the corner from the fence. She's right here, and she will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, and she'll change locations, maybe, and I'll let you guys know on my Instagram and Twitter. But how I simply get here, my spawn point, as you guys should know, if you're not new, I spawn at my, around my moonshine shack because I, that's like the last place I go before I close out the game and stuff like that. So I kind of spawn around here in this area. Where I just simply ride down to her location. But if you are not in this location, just simply fast travel to Emerald Station. And it should, when it does put you around here somewhere, just run right there. It's super close to the fast travel. So you don't have anything, you know, to worry about anything like that. I wouldn't move any camps or anything like that. As I said, I do move my camp for Big Valley when she's up here. In Big Valley near the creek or and when she's down here in Rio Bravo area those are the only time that I move my camps because those are the areas that aren't really close to a fast travel so just fast travel to Emerald Station and she's right there right out the way Anywho, let's go to our next thing which is the Caribbean rum which today it's in Van Horn is right here on this boat right here. Right there in that square that is a boat on the second level of that boat, the top level of that boat, boat in other words. There's there's a table and on that table just grab it off. Super easy. It disappeared while I was talking, so oh man, something might have popped up. Anyway, let's go over here to where we normally do business so I can tell you guys everything i try to zoom in as close as possible so you guys can see everything that's on the map but the cycles for today sunday may 30th are family heirloom cycle three all luxury cycle two coin cycle three arrowhead cycle one wildflower cycle two antique alcohol bottle cycle six all tarot card cycle three bird egg cycle four and fossils cycle two remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there the cycles a link to a video including the i mean a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the twitter and instagram for the channel which is hitman miyagi yt Let's get to these things that we will find across a little 
one more in area of the map. We're gonna start at this topmost item, which is a family heirloom. This family heirloom is, this is a dig spot. You only need your shovel for this. It's a family heirloom, and this family heirloom is a metal hairpin. That was one that I really needed for a long while, so I, I try to collect that anytime I do see it like in a, in a, I guess, a, a closer spot to like the areas that I be in. But this is a metal hairpin. You do not need your metal detector for this because it's, it's like a dig, like a pile of dirt, and you just have to dig that pile of dirt. But go and get that. Let's go over to our next marker, which is inside this house. This marker is a tortoise shell cone. Tortoise shell cone. It's inside the house on the wash table. Let's go down to our next marker, which is a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you guys what fossil you will get. But come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get. A random fossil. Let's go over here to our next marker below the word bayou. Or really below the word or the O in the word bayou. And right here at this location, inside this house, there's a chimney. And inside that chimney, you guys will get a Durant Pearl bracelet. Just position yourself in front of the chimney. And you should get a prompt to search it. You will get a Durant Pearl bracelet once again. While you're inside the house, there's another item, which is a tarot card in this corner right here on the bookshelf. This tarot card is a Eight of Wands, so grab that as well. And the other item that's in this area that I did not mark is a Random Lost Jury. It's another random lost jury, or it is a random lost jury, because this is a random, this is a lost jury as well. It's not random, because we know that's a Durant Pearl bracelet. But right here, you have to dig for this one. Go towards this big tree that's in the yard, and right around the base of that tree, come over here with your metal detector, and right around the base of that tree, you guys will get a random lost jury. Um, do I want to continue going? There's another fossil over here underneath the bridge along the shoreline. Come over here with your metal detector and you will get another random fossil. Let's go over to our next couple items or markers. Right here at this marker, you guys will get a bird egg. This bird egg is a heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. It's in a tree, so shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's go over to our next marker, which is inside this mansion right here. Right here in front, there's a big, I guess a row of picture windows or whatever you wanna call them. But right here along this wall, there's a three-seater bench or a couple three-seater benches. And on one of those three-seater benches, you guys will get a ebony hairpin which is a family heirloom. Let's go over to our next marker, which is inside the saloon. If you guys see the mark, the picture over to the left, that's the saloon. Go inside the saloon, go towards the back room, and on the back shelf, you guys will get a tarot card, and that tarot card is a six of wands. Let's go over to our next marker which is right here on this island make your way over and around to this marker right here and you guys will get a antique alcohol bottle this antique alcohol bottle is sitting in a broken boat next to like a skeleton skeleton plays no big significance to the bottle but inside the boat that you will get a Irish whiskey antique alcohol bottle. Go back over onto the land and to our next marker, which is a cardinal flower. This cardinal flower is a cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day that helps me personally 
indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for the day, which is cycle six. No, cycle two, sorry. Anywho, let's go to this next marker, which before we get to that next marker, there's a, a um, random arrowhead right here at this location, right under the G and Glade. It's in the little trenches right here. You should see, like if you use your, your eagle eye, you should see the fairy, the sparkly fairy dust, the indicator for that there's a dig spot. All you need is your shovel. You do not need your metal detector, but go and grab that random arrowhead. This is up here, right up a little bit, inside a stone outline of a house. Stand in the middle of that with your metal detector and you guys will get a coin at this next marker. This coin is randomized. I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get. But that's what that is right there at that marker at that location inside the O of Meadows. Let's go up to Rhodes a little bit. I'm going to tell you a couple of tarot cards because that's all that's really in Rhodes for this cycle. There's a tarot card right here inside at the, at the ground level of this building. I think on a crate or a barrel. You guys will find a six of pentacles tarot card and there's also a tarot card up here next to the fence which is a five of wands so go get that as well that is on a crate or barrel as well uh let's go up to our next marker there's also a tarot card over here in between this uh barn right here that's the eight of swords our next marker Right here inside this building, like right in the middle. As soon as you walk through the door, look directly in front of you, you should see a tall wardrobe. That tall wardrobe, inside that tall wardrobe, you guys will get a ebony hairbrush, which is a family heirloom as well. Right here at our next marker, you guys will see a dig spot. This dig spot is the dig spot of a random arrowhead. This arrowhead is right beside a, or this dig spot is right next to a tree stump. So when you do come over this area, use your eagle eye and you should see it. Uh, one more that I wanted to tell you guys about is inside this building or inside this house. Inside the house, on the fireplace, you guys will get a 10 of Pentacles tarot card. That's pretty much it for, for the extras that I have for you guys. If you need any help finding anything or anything like that, remember to comment down below because I, I will I will be glad to help you guys out and do a live stream or do a video or something like that to help you find the item for today and today's cycle or the next 24 hours in the cycle. I don't want to say next 24 hours because it's more like 23 hours. But the cycles, remember the cycles are available from 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I will be back with another video. The cycles for today, once again, are Family Heirloom Cycle 3, All Auxiliary Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 6, All Tarot Card Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 4 and Fossil Cycle 2. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 3, All Auxiliary Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 6, All Terror Card Cycle 3, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossils Cycle 2. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate each and every bit of it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, commenting I don't think you've commented in a while but when you do comment I do appreciate it I don't get all notifications but when I do see them I try to make sure you guys see that I see them or you know see that I acknowledge I try to acknowledge you guys so you guys I know that I'm paying attention to the channel but 
Thank you guys for liking, sharing, commenting. And if you haven't or if you don't know, remember to like, share, comment, and hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out because I do put out videos each and every day. It is your main man, Hitman, once again with another video, and I will be back tomorrow. I don't think I'm going to do any live streams right now because I'm waiting on a repairman for my TV. But <laughs> thank you guys for watching, and I'm out.